in here, all right. I've changed my mind. This is no dungeon, it's a sty. I said you're the one that stinks, Hamshanks. Hear me now? You all right, Vaughn? Just don't give up, do they? Now is looking like a good time for us to leave. Through the oubliette, there's a way out. Only... Only you sense the mist. What did you call me? Say that again. What? You couldn't hear? I merely said that a lot of you are incompetent fools. If you've the Sky Pirate in your hands, where is he? You'd have done better, Bagamnon. By your own words, it was the Imperial Army who caught this Sky Pirate of yours. We've done your job for you. We don't require the assistance of filthy head others. The Empire will restore order here. Eh? What's that you say now? Maybe I'll wet my blade on you before I kill Bathir. That's enough, Bagam, then. <sighs> hey, judge. Judge? Hmm. <laughs> The self-proclaimed guardians of law and order in Arcadia. They're the elite guard of House Solidor, which effectively makes them the commanders of the Imperial Army. If you ask me, they're more executioners than judges. Not a friendly lot, at any rate. What are they doing here? The Emperor is willing to overlook race for his more talented servants. However, those that do not show respect will receive none in kind. Your Honor... You travel freely through our lands because the Emperor wills it. Am I correct? <sighs> we 
Where is the captain? We have him in solitary, Your Honor. We're ready to begin our interrogation. <laughs> this does not concern you, Bounty Hunter. Uh, he's in here somewhere. Find him. Watch it. That way. He's uh, going this uh, way. Uh, what's that? Spoiler time for the hare to follow the fox. Uh, uh, huh? The magic's binding the door to the Obliatra quite strong. Too strong even for my talents. That's why we'll get them to open it for us. How is going deeper into this What's place? What's wrong? You don't trust her. Fiera's nose is a sharp. If she says there's a way out, there's a way out. Look. Ah, the prison repository of rested relics and raiments. So, our things are in here? That's what I said. and cut purses down here. I've had my fill of chains. Let's tread lightly, shall we? You have grown very thin, Bosch. Less than a shadow, less than a man. Sentenced to death, and yet you live? Why? To silence Hondor. How many times must I say it? Is that all? Why not ask Vane himself? Is he not one of your masters? <sighs> We've caught a leader of the insurgents. She's being brought from Rabinasta, the woman, Amalia. Who could that be? Such a faithful hound to cling so to a falling kingdom. Better than throwing it away. Throwing it away, as you threw away our homeland. Who's there? This the place? The mist is flowing through this room. It must be going somewhere. Hmm. You, you're no Imperials. Please, you must get me out. It's against my policy to speak with the dead. Especially when they happen to be Kingslayers. I did not kill him. Is that so? Huh. Glad to hear it. Please, get me out. For the sake of Dalmasca. Delmasca? What do you care about Delmasca? Everything that's happened is because of you! Everyone that's died, every single one, even my brother. You killed my brother! Quiet! The guards will hear. I'm dropping it. 
pirates without a sky. your quiddities. Yeah, but, but he's a... A traitor, I know. Stay here and fight if you want. If you can walk, let's go. You're taking him with us? We could use another sword arm. And you have it. I've heard of these. Mimics. They disguise themselves as all manner of things, then strike when you're least wary. Some of them have a fondness for energy, I'm told. They gorge themselves on the stuff till there's naught left. So, um, what happens then? Lights out, and it's worse in the dark. Much worse. So, let them get too close to one of those conduits, and they'll suck it dry. But don't worry, it'll give the energy back if you ask nicely. Sticking it with a sword helps too. Clock's ticking. Mist seethes. It reeks. Something's close. Nice moves there, Captain. You mean traitor? So they say. But I didn't see him kill anyone. My brother did. <sighs> Rex. He said he had a brother two years younger. I see. He meant you. Your brother. What became of- He's dead. I'm sorry. It was you who killed him! I give you my word, that was not the way of it. Rex, sir. My hands are Rex. all I have left, sir. He's two years younger than I. Living it's time, Bosch. Save the discussion for later. We found them! But if we arrive after he signed the treaty... Sir! We have no, little sir. time. You must I go to the tank. They're slowing us down. Captain and for please. my parents. Captain, why? Our king, what have you done? His majesty was a traitor. Twin brother. Fancy that. Hmm. But still, the pieces fit, I'll give you that much. And he did look like you. I don't believe you. Of course not. It was my fault that Rex was there. I am sorry. My brother, he trusted you. He trusted you and he lost everything. How can I believe you? Not me, then. Believe in your brother. He was a fine soldier. He fought to the last to protect his homeland. Now, surely he fought to protect his brother. You don't know anything! Believe what you want to, whatever it takes to make you happy. What's done is done.
To think Dalmascan air could taste so sweet. Where are we? The Esther Sand, by the look of it. Let's back to Rabanasta before we shrivel up. By your leave, Captain. Yes, the hour of my return is already over late. The people may hate me, but that does not free me of my charge. I thank you. I'd avoid crowds if I were you. In this town, you're still a traitor, you know. The Resistance will surely find me soon. 
Fates well, we meet again. I would pay my respects to your brother. You're a fugitive now too. Stay low for a while. What about the stone? Do as you like. That stone's ill-favored. We feel regret. We sought that stone and found ourselves only worry. You offering it? It's mine. Then why'd you ask? Our regards to your girl. We stay in Rabanastra a while. What do you think? Can I trust Bosch? I gotta get rid of this thing. But maybe I should show it to Pinello first, so she knows I got something. She'd be at Miguel's place this time of day. Vaughn, is it really you? I heard you got took off to Nalbina. The Imperials will need more than a dungeon to stop me. You broke out of a dungeon? Whoa! Hey, try and keep it down, would you? Pinello isn't around, is she? Out on a delivery, maybe? Nope, haven't seen her all day. Not like her to up and skip out on work like that. Miguelo's not here either. He went running off somewhere a little while ago. So much for my big welcome. I guess everybody's busy. I got my hands full watching the shop, and old Dallin had something for me to do, but I can't get away. Old Dallin, huh? Tell you what, I'll go see him for you. Really? Well, no one in her family. Then... Then the war came. I am sorry. You don't have to keep apologizing. Really, it's all right. I know it wasn't your fault. I see that now. You didn't kill my brother. It was the Empire. My brother trusted you. And he was right. As I said, a misunderstanding. Misunderstanding? What I am understanding is it's with Pinello because of you! What? What about Pinello? Oh, Vaughn! They've taken Pinello! And there was a note, a note for this Balthier. Come to the Museum of Mines, it said. It's Begamnon. He was in Nalbina. If anything were to happen to that sweet child, why, I've her parents' memory to consider. You're going to go to her aid, and that's that. That's what you Sky Pirates do, isn't it? I don't respond well to orders. You do know that the Imperial fleet is massing at Bujerba. Fine, then I'll go. You at least have an airship, don't you? Just get me there, and I'll find Pinello myself. I'll join you. Huh? I have some business there as well. An audience with a Marquis, by chance? Both here. Just take us, and this is yours. The gods are toying with us. Uh, make yourselves ready. We leave soon. Right. This is the Stroud. She airship enough for you. <laughs> the Stroll. You really are a Sky Pirate. Well, the Headhunters seem to think so. What's a good word? Is she ready? So is she armed? How fast is she? Could she take the free? I suppose I could tell you, but... Wouldn't you rather see for yourself? Hmm? Yeah. Fran, our course. The shortest way is over Dorstonis. How flies, Bushava? Oh, she's free as can be, for now. 
Empire took notice when they announced the princess's unfortunate suicide in your entire execution. If it becomes known that I'm alive, the Marquis will lose their favor. I will try to steer clear of such things. Right, it's time to fly. And no wagging tongues or you'll like to bite them off. I'm coming. come from Ravanaster. The Stral she sets sail. She makes straight for the sky city of Bajerba. Barely know, was it? Yet all trace he goes bounding off for you. Tell me, how could that be? I... That's what I'd like to know. I just met him that one time and that's Does it. Does that tongue never stop? What if we plucked it from your head? As for you, we need Balthier alive. His corpse fetches but half the bounty. A tender beaten, my specialty. There's no fun for it if we can't tease out a scream or two. Where are you? No good, he's not here. Keep searching! This way! You're a dead man. Don't forget it. And no names. Of course. The Lusu Mines. One of the richest veins in Ivalice. Under Imperial Guard, no doubt. Actually, no. With but few exceptions, the Imperial Army is not permitted within Bujerba. Well, shall we proceed? Forgive me for asking, but you are diverting the purest of the Magicite. I can assure you it reaches Lord Vane most discreetly. Ha! <laughs> you wear your saddle well. Be that as it may, I have no intention of being bridled, Your Honor. Then you prefer the whip? Stubbornness will see not only you broken, Excellency, but Bujerba as well. Halim Ondor IV, 
the Marquis of Bougerba. The Marquis served as mediator at the negotiations of Damascus' surrender. It would appear that he is somewhat less neutral now. They say he's been helping the resistance. They say many things. You're certainly well informed. Who did you say you were again? What difference does it make? We have to find Pinello. And Pinello is your... She's a friend. She was kidnapped and taken here. This is what I came here to see. What's that? It's nethesite. Manufactured nethesite. Nethesite? Unlike regular magicite, nethesite absorbs magical energy. This is the fruit of research into the manufacture of nethesite. All at the hands of the Draclaw Laboratory. So this is where they're getting the magicite. Errand all attended to, then? Thank you. I'll repay you shortly. No, you'll repay us now. We have too much on our hands to go on holding yours. So, where did you hear this fairy tale about Nethesite? And where did you get that sample you carry? What do you know about the Draclaw Laboratories? Tell me, who are you? Balthier? You kept us waiting, Balthier! You slipped away in Nalbana! We missed you! First to judge and know this boy! The whole affair has a smell of money about it! I may have to wet my beak a little! Keep your snout in the trough where it belongs. This thinking ill befits you, Bagamnon. Balthier! <laughs> Too long have I gone unpaid! I'll carve my bounty out of that boy! Where's Pinello? We're taking her back! The girl? Why keep the bait when you've landed the fish? We cut her loose on the way here, and then off she ran, crying like a babe! Hey! After them! Hey, wait up! We'll not be able to take them all. Fight who we must, leave the rest!
It would not seem they follow. We've lost them. Much more running about with Bunga at my heels, and I'm apt to give up sky pirating altogether. I see you've been out walking without the company of your cortege, Lord Lhasa. We caught her wandering out of the mines. You must take care with such undesirables about. I was kidnapped! Silence! And... If it is a crime to wander on one's own, then I too am guilty. Marquis, I trust that your estate can accommodate another guest. Why not? Judge Geese, I shall heed your counsel. I will not travel unaccompanied any longer. That was unexpected. Thank you, Penelo. Uh, of course. What's Penelo doing? And what's the deal with that Lamont? That's no Lamont. Lhasa Ferina Solidor, fourth son to Emperor Gramis and brother to Vane. What? That kid? Do not worry. I believe he will treat her well. Nobody knows men like Frandas. Our purposes lead the same way, to Andor. We must find means to approach him. The Marquis is channeling money to organizations opposing the Empire. We'll start there. This is the one, Havaro. Says he's Captain Bosch, he does. <laughs> he would sooner pass for the king. I knew he were no captain. That was a mean trick to be playing. If a trickery it ended, it would end well enough. But why this boy? And why Captain Ronsenberg? An explanation is due, and I will hear it. The Empire's hounds grow passing bold indeed. A shame if they learnt the Marquis trafficked with the likes of you. Agents masquerading as guides, a hideout at the back of a tavern? Not exactly earning high marks for originality, are we? Now you've done Wait. it! So Bash von Ronsenberg does yet live. So Vaughn really is all right. I didn't think I'd ever get to see him again. You will join him soon. And until then, I shall see that you are kept from harm. Thank you. I am troubled. The Rabanaster Imperial Guard appear to have overstepped their bounds. I intend to speak on this with the Consul. What? Vane Solidor, the Consul, is my brother. The first duty of the Consul is to maintain order in Dalmasca. My brother... my brother is not one given to failure. Perhaps things aren't going as well as they might be, but give him a little time and he will put things to rights. Be not troubled. My brother is a remarkable man. He frightens me. Why? I'm sorry. He is your brother. It's just... You don't understand how much we lost to the war. My friends. My parents. So you fear the Empire? Listen to me. The men of my family, we are taught to place the needs of others before those of our own. I will see that you are kept from harm. It is my duty to House Solidor. But how? How can I trust you? Because I give you my word. My brother would do no less. I knew there must be more to it, but to find you at the end of this tale? <laughs> ah, to see the Marquis's face when he learns of it. 
I should like nothing more. I would meet him and see for myself. How say you, my lord? There is little to be said. I shall arrange a meeting with the Marquis. We shall expect you at the estate. Come <laughs> on. 